Hey Pisces, how you doing? It's your girl Ruth. Welcome back to another weekly health advice from Ancestors, Spirit Guides, Divine Source, Higher Self, Your Higher Self, um, Black God and Goddesses, God and Goddesses, whoever you believe in. Let's see what they want to say this week with my little cards. See what the heads up is or maybe someone you know. Okay, something should be working on. Let's see what they got going on. They didn't have to throw you three cards on the floor. <laughs> Let's see what that is. They is, they are Pisces. We got feet. Be careful with the feet this week. And uh, be careful of people burning, doing some witchcraft on your feet. I had that experience. Okay. Your thighs. Maybe you've been exercising or something like that. I need to. Blood type, find out yours so you can eat right and know who you are. Very important. Okay. Those things will be very important for you this week, Pisces. Okay, Pisces, we got the tarot. So I see somebody had you messed up, huh? Trying to give you their energy. Okay, let's see. Um, you know you're an alchemist, right? Two of swords, confusion we face when we are forced to make difficult choices not seeing the problem or solution let it flow you letting it flow all right um you know it will work out ancient knowledge you already know stuck in the middle at a crossroad denial not seeing clearly you're not even doing that you were confused you're not now in love choosing between two lovers career two career paths conflicts stay or go finances avoiding financial decisions Ten of Wands, overload and burden situations, too much responsibility has been put on you, burden, duty, love, burden and love and stress, career, overwork, needing help for, from colleagues, financial struggle daily, Five of Wands reverse, end of conflict, conflict, cooperation, agreements, harmony, peace, okay. Um, in love, avoiding conflict at work with co-workers, career, resolved conflict, and financial peace after stress. Then we got the Ten of Pentacles, legacy, roots, ancestors, family, inheritance, windfall, foundation, stability, tradition. Okay, and love, uh, financial stability, you and your mate career creating lasting careers and financial windfall of inheritance so you might have got a big old blessing coming okay um so you're not tripping on none of that <laughs> okay did i do um ten of pentacles okay and we got the king of swords and we got the king of swords reason authority discipline integrity serious high standards strict in love, high standards in love, control emotions, career, stern but righteous, mentor, challenge to do your best, and finances, being disciplined, law, logical, eight of wands, trapped, restricted, victim, helpless, in love, feeling trapped in love, su suffocated, in career, depending on job, can't change career, and finances, anxiety about money. So somebody's trying to send you some juju on the boo boo boo, trying to make you think that about your life and you know it's not okay nice try huh okay <laughs> okay pisces got my little egyptian cards okay we're gonna start with k for cancer we'll see for cancer but you know king of hearts and it says um the cups is mild reserved home loving and pleasant masculine energy i feel good um Oh, I feel good. Oh, I was being, trying to be funny. I feel good. Da -na -na. Jane Brown. Um, lovers, not fighters. At least not the way they think, right? Person quali personal qualities. Honesty. Spirituality. Kind-hearted person. Fair man or woman. Masculine energy. Gentle and excellent partner. Okay? Which, since Castor is a feminine sign. Then we got the Jack of Diamonds and the coin. So that's Aquarius and it's 
reverse. Someone tried to take your pe your place jealous, hypocritical, so be careful and remain aware. Yeah, these people, you're highly spiritual, have all the elements you need to protect yourself and your family. Corn, short journey or not. 13, the Reaper. Okay, let's read the Reaper. Find the key. Oh, the mercy. Take your place. How are they going to be you? Uh, expresses the spiritual world, the perpetual movement of creation, destruction, and renewal. Intellectual world, the ascension of the spirit into divine spheres. Physical world, natural death, that is to say, the transition through which the soul leaves its physical form, henceforth to function in the astral form and the astral world. You, they know you never die. You know what I'm saying? Might uh, return to sender anyway. Remember thy son of earth. The terrestrial things are short duration and that the highest powers are reaped as the grass of the field. 13, 13 should appear in a prophetic sign of the horoscope. The dissolution of thy organs will come sooner than thy expected. But do not dread it, for death is but the perpetuation of another life. The universe reabsorbs without ceasing all which springs from her bl blossom that has not spiritualized itself. But the releasing of ourselves from material instincts by a free and voluntary apprehension of our souls to the laws of universe, universal movement constitutes in us the creation of a second man, a celestial man, and begins our immortality. Okay, you know this by a call it the, um, what are they call them people? Uh... Da, 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 da. I can't think of their name like right now. I was trying to look at it. Anyway, the Masonics. Okay, then we have uh, Yeah. Okay, then we got nine. And that is Aquarius also. No, I missed thirteen. No, that was thirteen. So that was Aries. I said I hope I said Aries and not Aquarius. That was Aries. Okay. So we got nine, that's Aquarius, wisdom or prudence. So let's look for number nine. And we have the sage. Okay, and expression of spiritual world, absolute wisdom, intellectual world, prudence, direction of will, physical world, circumspection, guide of actions. Remember then thy son, prudence is the arm of the wise. Circumspection enables one to avoid snares and abscess and to foresee treason. Treason, Take it for thy guide in all thy actions, even in the least. Nothing is indifferent here below. A pebble can overturn the chariot of the master of the world. Thirteen should, nine should appear in prophetic signs of thy horoscope. Keep in mind that speech is silver and silence is gold. Hello. Okay, well now we got number two. So let's read two. Yeah, you ain't got to tell them that you know at all. This veiled Isis. Okay, they don't know who you are. Okay, Paul Dine. Uh, expresses spiritual world, the consciousness of absolute being, which embraces the three terms of all manifestation, the past, present, and the future. And intellectual world, the binary, reflection of unity, and the perception of things visible and invisible. Physical world, woman, the mode of man uniting, uniting herself with him in order to accomplish an equal destiny. Son of, son of earth, that the mind of is enlightened in seeking God with the eyes of the will. God has said, let there be light, and light indulged space. Man should say, let truth show itself, and good come to me. And if man possesses a healthy will, he will see the truth shine, and guided by it will attend all to which he aspires. If veiled Isis should appear in the prophetic signs of thy horoscope, strike resolutely at the door 
of the funeral, the future, sorry. Resolute at the door of the future, and it will open to you. But study for a long time the door you should enter. Turn your face toward the Son of Justice, and the knowledge of truth will be given you. Keep silent in regard to your intentions, so as not to be influenced by the contradictions of men. Hello, people, people. All right, Pisces, we've got my little Tatiana cards, and we've got the anchor, security, settled. Things remain settled, positive, stand, stand put, okay, belief, etc. Next to the fish, which the fish is reversed, that's your card. Looks money good, maybe trying to take money in some sort of way. Then we have the flower, happiness, sometimes young girls, very positive, lovely after illnesses or return of someone brings happiness, be encouraged. And say next to the fish, which is reversed, which be granted. So maybe the kids will try to con you out of something. Maybe it's just simple as that. You know what I'm saying? Or use your credit card or something like that. Uh, they got the clover, lucky, blooming, positive, protected from evil. Wear it, protect you and yours. Magic uh, from worry. So use your creativity. Into sorrows, help, good money, good money and love. Good, trust in divine, wish being granted, next to child, happy even even awaits you. Child, children, early stages of something, love or business, maybe pregnant, congratulations. Positive or childlike, next to the fish, which is still reverse. Business and, and finances, so something about the business as well, y'all. Flowers, happy card, okay. So if you had any miscarriage or anything, uh, my condolences, I'm so sorry. Uh, fish reversed again, fortune, money, and uh, ideas, pregnancy, happy card of happy, card of money, clover, next to the clover, good luck, someone stealing from you maybe, or maybe just a business deal not working one way, try another one, okay, got to do with business, so I don't know either or, y'all, y'all figure that one out, okay. If it's even pertaining to you, it might be someone else you know. Pisces, maybe you're looking for some Mother Nature's plant they gave you four. Fireweed grows outside. Research more about it. Ancient medicine. Okay. Look up before use. Use as an herb medicine. Pain, swelling, inflammation, fever. Tumors, wounds, enlarged prostate, benign prosthetic, hyperplasma. Uh, BPH as an antigen and as a tonic. Read more for pregnancy and breastfeeding. Vitamin E, free radicals, high germs, fight germs, keeps blood vessels open, clear of clots, fat, soluble, vitamin, uh, poison, Madagascar, fire field, causes weight loss, jaundice, lungs, blindness, sudden death. Uh, muscular something, but look it up first. They always saying it's always doing something, but the ancients been using it for years. Uh, wild uh, onion medicine plant make a tea loosens uh, up congestion from colds. Hold on one second. Okay, loosens up colds, bronchitis, sinuses infections, prevent infection. Reduce swelling on cuts, bruises, scrapes, stings, prevents cancer, problems with gut health, heart, brain health, and bone health. Make sure you choose the right plant. One plant is poison, one is not. Elderberries, uh, syrup can take every day, eat sometimes. Uh, antioxidants, uh, boost immune system. Tame inflammation, loosen stress, help pr protect your heart, prevent and ease cold and flu symptoms, side effects, nausea, vomiting, raw berries, don't eat the raw berries, weaknesses, dizziness, numbness, stupid, whatever that other one is. And we got the cactus, prickly plant, Spanish use this a lot for diabetes, high cholesterol, obesity, hangovers, antivirus, vitamin COVID-19, herpes, respiratory virus, HIV, 
nerve cells, high antioxidant cells, free radicals, blood sugar, and large prostate, side effects, headache, nausea, bloating, and diarrhea, and increased stool. So research that as well. Anything I say, research. Yeah, you already know, whatever. I don't feel going hungry, being alone, being overweight by eating, overeating, or being poor. I don't steal from my job or family. I don't need no one to always boost me up. I try not to worry. <laughs> I will not ruin my kids' lives or mine. I don't like to make others jealous. If I'm bisexual, I will tell my partner or who I meet not wanting to get tricked into it or do it to others. I can't follow instructions. I am very grateful. I walk away when I'm angry, won't hurt no one or mess up their stuff or mine. Listen until answered listening listen until asked to answer i cannot i am a chameleon or i can see that people like and love me i have good manners i like being with my man i don't know what is best all the time my intuition is on point I am confident. Hello. I have my little cards. We got magic. Hello. Your bird creation, sky, sun, moon, stars, universe. When you eat the right food, stay. They stay make, in your body, makes you healthy. The waste comes out. That's magic since people might not believe in it. They can't have you. Okay. I am awesome. Hello. Doubt, loyalty. Okay. Do you pray for people? Do you have mental health? Is it parasites in your brain and body? Use herbs. A pimp spying on you. Hmm. Witchcraft put on you. Train to kill, cleaner, bounty hunter, marksman. Hmm. I'm trying to situate these cards. <laughs> I am remarkable. They said that twice. Create something you might feel better. No more stealing people's bodies to bring back your loved ones. No more companies and laboratories that make the poison food and put and put in stores. I know that's better for me. I made myself change, not you. Okay. Then we got three, four, five. Okay. Return to sender. Hello. Are you taking your time? I'm funny, fun, friendly, and loving, so you missed out. I've learned I learned my lessons with you and I'm gone. I'm always going to flourish. Okay. Hello. Have you gave your partner a gift, hug, kiss, praise today? Have you forgotten someone who who's passed on? Feeling yourself and them. Have you forgotten? Okay. Okay. Hmm. Do you feel safe and secure and stable? Yes, I'm brave and brilliant. Do they have, do they know how much y'all you sacrifice for them? Probably not. Do a shock of wisdom. I'm going to let you go, Pisces. Third chakra solar plexus, oneness and unity. I accept the oneness of all life, and I know I am with 
I know I am one with all others on this journey. I support them and let them support me. I am brave and not afraid to ask for assistance. I allow myself to empathize and sympathize with others, and I choose to see the love in all around me. I see everything as part of my own life, and I accept others for who they are. I find common ground with others rather than differences, as this brings harmony into my life and into theirs. Hello. All right, Pisces, that's what I got for you. This is your girl, Ruth, signing off. Would you like, subscribe, share, and comment? I hope it helps in some type of way or maybe someone you know, okay? All right, love you. Bye.